Okay, now when I get in the water this time, I'm going to reverse the process. The wind's coming from my right, and the nose is going to want to swing to the right. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to raise this wheel first, and this one over here will drag me to the left. That's what I want to do. Make sure I'm on the ramp. There's the ramp. See, I don't trust these brakes when they get wet. So I want to make sure I'm lined up. Okay, we don't want to hit the water going too fast. So we're all, looks pretty good on both sides from here. Okay, and remember we're going to raise this landing gear. Okay, once we're in the water, and we are settled in, so we're going to raise this. See how the nose is swinging? It's not happy going, going this way. It wants to be, okay, so that wheel is up. Now let me get out of here. I'll still use, this one's down. It's dragging me. So I'll use it to let me get out of here. Okay. Get that wheel up. Okay, so the wheels are up. Watch this, it'll just turn right into the wind. See, I got the rudders neutral. It wants to point into the wind. So here we go, take off.
windows up. That's the most important thing. So that's uh, pretty much fun. I love this little thing. Of course, we can't see. Now, usually when I get here, I undo my seat belt and I scoot myself up so I can see better.
turn on the air conditioning. Shut it off with a mixer. All right, so mags, master, fuel. That's what I always do. Okay, okay so we got the little hatch open. There's a couple little things here that we need to do. Finish up. This up here is actually an oil shut off. We always shut the oil off. That little thing comes down. It's got a little red thing and over here I've got a little flag to remind us to make sure that we always push that up. So the oil shut off now so it won't drip. And also we got a couple other little things here that we uh, install. up there. Okay, so we got a pedo cover. Keep the little mud daubers, that's my airspeed indicator. Uh, it's where the air goes in, the ram air goes in to make the airspeed dial move. And mud daubers love to make nests up there. And then here because we've got hydraulic pressure on the deal. We've got these little things here that Dick made to put them there to make sure that if the pressure drops, it doesn't go down on the hull. So we always put those in as a safety. And it uh, seems like our little tape's working great. Like I said, it was just about 70 degrees, which is just perfect. Um, next time. Now is this cool or what? Turn the can over.